and welcome to our hour-long 200th episode celebration. We're here at the Goose Island Tap Room with the entire CB crew and a few of our most loyal viewers. And in honor of our 200th episode, we're taking a look back at some of our favorite restaurants and giving you guys the opportunity to pick some of your favorites in the ultimate showdown, The Battle. Chicago's best. That's right, we're letting you pick between Chicago institutions like Vito and Nick's and Pat's Pizza. Kuma's and Illinois Bar and Grill. That Donut and Weber's Bakery. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. And tonight, we're announcing the winners in front of all you guys. Though these restaurants are all completely different, they'll have one thing in common. The hardworking families that make these restaurants so great. So where do you think we should start, Brett? Well, we can't get more Chicago than with a hot dog. So, what better way to kick off the episode than with the epic face-off between Superdog and Fat Johnny? So who won? Should we get a drum roll or something? Ooh, and the winner is... Superdog. Here. I never said it was easy. Back in 2014 for our Milwaukee Avenue show. And now I'm back because this is the best. There's no debate. Of the best. As we always say, Hiya, thanks for stopping. Hiya, thanks for stopping. Can I take your order, please? You guys get awards and people talk about you all the time. But how does it feel to know that Chicagoans have voted you the best hot dog? We're proud because we know we serve a great product. Hey, what's up? What's up? We're humble because my parents built themselves. Number 90, lots of numbers. And they enjoy doing it. And we enjoy doing it. Everyone kind of knows if you want a hot dog in Chicago. Super dog. Super dog. It's super dog. It's part of the nostalgia of living here. You can go anywhere and mention it. People know about it. You know it's good because it has super in the name. They are super. If you want a hot dog in Chicago, this is the place to come. Thank you. Ours is a special recipe, extra large, larger than most. They're extra smoky, extra garlicky. From 1948, when we first opened until now, we changed almost nothing. The recipe super dog is the same. The crinkle cut fry that we hand cut is the same. Served in the box, super dogs on the roof, car hop service, all exactly the same as 1948. That's the stuff you don't want to change. No, 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 no. You want it no. nice, consistent. This is the real deal. If you're good next week, where will we get to go? Super there you go. Two years after Elliot tried his hand at crafting the perfect super dog. Not that difficult. It's my turn. I heard when Elliot was here, he didn't do that great of a job. Fries on top. You lost your dog. And you forgot the tomato and the pepper. I obviously can't keep up with this. Yes. It's okay, Elliot. 200th episode. You get the A-team this time. We like A-teams. <laughs> Take our super dog. This is my guess how it goes from here. We're going to do the mustard. Then we put on the relish. Then the onions. Pickle goes on after that. Here's the tricky part. We're just gonna pop it against our bellies there. Yeah, I got a little extra pop. Got a little extra <laughs> pop there. So now I add the peppers and I'm gonna add our tomatoes. That's a super dog. That's the but super But also dog. you've got another special one for me that's a big favorite. Whoopski dog. Our Wolfski dog is much different than your traditional Chicago Maxwell Street Polish. Oh. We based it in our special sauce, which is like barbecue sauce. We've we got use. our onion bun coming through. And we're going to serve it with grilled onions and pickles. Ski dog up! And dinner is served. It's not your regular hot dog. Best hot dog ever. They're different than any other hot dog. Superest dog in the world. So last time we were here, we had the Jeep Cherokee with Elliot. This time we're here, we have the Jeep Grand Cherokee. Very nice, so very classy. So in keeping with the theme, we took it up a notch. Very nice. <laughs> We've got the super dog do, for the classic, you, the yeah. classic. And then you made me a super cheesy. When you're pregnant, you're not supposed to eat hot dogs. That's what I've heard, yeah. So as soon as this baby pops, I'm coming back. Perfect. You guys don't change much because you're stay consistent. But there's been a couple things that have changed since we were here a few years ago. Number one is the hot dog emoji. We worked very hard to campaign for, and we won. And now there is a hot dog emoji with mustard on it. No ketchup. No ketchup. No ketchup. You hear this, people? <laughs> Just mustard, yeah. Only on the fries. If you could say something to fans, all of those that voted for you guys, what would you say to them? Thank you. Thank you. You guys are great. You're what's keeping us in business all these years and keeping us going for many more to come, too. It's the guilty pleasure. You guys love this place. Chicago loves this place. And now I love this place. 
Super Dog, it's Chicago's best 200 baby. Mm, save some room because you still got a whoopsie dog over here. Oh my goodness, you're right.